Hello Aries, welcome to the channel and this is going to be your weekly tarot reading 7th of May to uh, 13th of May. Four card spread, <clears throat> the first one is showing up the topic of your week and we got the four card for you Aries. The second card that shows up the core of the situation, <clears throat> that will be the uh, Empress card. Third card shows up the obstacles the, or the challenges that you Aries needs to overcome. That will be the Six of Wands. And the last one is the Guidance card. This is going to be the Sun. Alright, so uh, it does look like that this is going to be a brand new topic for Aries during this particular week. Uh, <clears throat> what we do have here, guys, which makes an impression is these couple of cards, the Fool and the High Priestess, with conjunction of the Sun card that is as a, a guidance for you, which means that it is kind of like a, a new goal into your life or into your field uh, in a sense of uh, it is tough to express it really, it is tough to explain it. Let's say that this is a, an emerging of a new perspective, it is because you have done whatever you could until this very moment. Either into your relationship or either into your career, now it's time, it's time for you Aries to glance upon new perspectives, upon new enterprises, new projects, new relationships etc etc, whatever new you can actually bring and uh, <clears throat> implement into your current position, state, estate, life, etc. So what happens with the four guys is that that, that is the topic and the four as a keyword here goes new beginning. And not only just new beginning but the brand new beginning. The four is the card sitting in between two infinities you know you have finished one of the infinity which was the life until right now and you need to start striving toward the new perspective or right toward the new goal which could be as i said either a new relationship or either a new career and the core of this is the empress card and this is uh, <clears throat> a card pointing that at you uh, right now not just you could have, you did everything you could regarding your uh, situation, either in a good or in a bad shape, but also the card points, guys, that you are somewhat finding yourself mature enough in order to foresee and scale very accurately that new perspective, and you alone are going to realize that this is once probably in a lifetime shot for you to take on either the person as I said you are interested at or the job that you are interested at. Very important here as well with the Empress is to realize that you need to keep on the maturity going for what I uh, and what I mean is that uh, whatever comes in your way during this week or even the weeks after Aries is you have to be rather calm and humble than being outbursting and emotional about it or frantic as well about it. Also the Empress card it is a about compassion all right not just um, maturity but also about compassion being ready to enthrall people through showing them that things can be not just conquered by aggression you know and by battles and wars but also they can be conquered by love you know and and compassionate and dedicated actions toward them very important to realize here guys is that you are making quite of an example for a lot of people and they're waiting for you to give them an advice for how to move on and proceed forward and the example and advice that you're going to give them is through your actions by taking on that new perspective coming into you uh, coming into your field guys and um, you capitalizing on it and straighting towards your new goal or towards your new future if I may say that way because what we do have here the uh, the fool and the Sun card speaks entirely for a, a new future should you have the brave uh, the bravery to take it because we go to the um, to these couple of cards here, challenges, six of wands, exactly what I said, bravery, guys. You need to be uh, more filled with more confidence that you actually deserve that kind of a new beginning or that kind of a person you are enthralled with or the project that it is offered to you. Basically, uh, you may start thinking the less of yourself, all right, when this, um, <clears throat> when this perspective comes into your um in your way and you may have the doubts can you actually bring it to its very end you know can you actually be successful in it you may start thinking that you don't have the qualification or rather you may start thinking that 
it is more than you can handle all right and this is entirely wrong way of how you need to think about it guys because this is the challenge again the challenge is to believe in yourself that you actually can pull it through and once you do so then we go to the guidance card which is the sun card pointing that you need to approach this new agenda of yours or perspective enterprise etc with great amounts of enthusiasm to realize that this is the natural unfoldment of your actions of the past and because you have acted correctly you have taken by the way a very correct decision uh, recently and based on that decision that you have uh, that you have taken being accountable not just toward only yourself but toward others as well this is why the universe is giving you a chance you know to build up something new for yourself and as I said you need to believe that this is the natural unfoldment here that it is actually meant for you to take it on and the Sun card also points that you in case you have some um, <clears throat> how can I place it uh, damaged communications and relationships all right before you actually start making any straights toward that new perspective you got to put the effort in order to fix those uh, and mend you know those relationships communications and etc because they may uh, play a, a vital role that you can actually um, achieve what you are after with a um, um, a faster motion so uh, pretty much that was for you Aries for the upcoming week a uh, as I said a new perspective is emerging for you guys and uh, I hope that you will have what it takes to capitalize on it with that being said uh, thank you all for watching and uh, <clears throat> in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video Rod signing out now see you next time bye